Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and for this week's video, I'm not going to be doing a budget with me because I didn't have time to set up my page so we're just going to be doing the cash envelope stuffing portion and then sorry for the low volume on my last video, I'm going to try to be louder on this one. So we're going to go ahead and start off with the envelopes I keep in my purse with me. So first we have is gas and gas. I think it still has money. It has two dollars in it, so I'm gonna take that and put that to the side. And we're gonna be putting in thirty dollars for gas. Okay. And then we have food. And I actually did really good with food. Like I actually didn't buy food like to eat. I had bought drinks. So we still have twenty dollars in here as well. And food is gonna be getting twenty dollars this week. I budgeted 10, I budgeted 30, but I think 20 will be it. good. And then for groceries, we still have $20, and I'm going to be budgeting 50. So we're going to do two 20s and a 10. Oh my god, the bank gave me such a crusty $10 bill. Like, it has like tape on it. So we have 50 in groceries. Okay. And then that'll be it for my envelopes in my wallet. We're gonna go ahead and get started with the cash envelopes. So, first we have is self care, which is getting $10. And currently we have some money here, and I'm getting my nails done tomorrow, so this is gonna get em almost empty. So we have 50, 70, 80, 90, 100. And then next is P.O. Box, and P.O. Box is getting $5. I don't think I'm going to be opening a P.O. Box because it seems like my mail system at my apartment complex is pretty okay. Like, they have, like, hub boxes, so I think I might not. But right now, we have $25 in P.O. Box. I'll just keep stuffing this for, like, the end of September, and if I feel like I do, I will open it. But if not, I'm just going to get rid of it. So then in subscriptions, we're going to be putting in $33. Subscriptions has some money in it already. So now subscriptions has 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. And I think for um, this paycheck, I need to go. My bills are $30, so I'm going to take $30 out. And then we already did groceries and food. And then for rollover, I'm going to put the rollover money in here. And then I think I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna redistribute half of it and then keep half of it in the rollover envelope in case I need to pull out for groceries because I feel like I might, but we'll see. So we have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 105, 6, 7. I'm surprised there's this much in here at the, and that was just from August. So that's pretty good. And then we did gas, and then utilities is getting $25. I still haven't had to pay for utilities yet, but I think I will soon, whenever it goes onto the account for my SMUD. So we have 50, 70, 90, 100, 105, 10. And that should be plenty for utilities. And then we have gifts, which is getting $50. And then I'm actually going to be buying gifts pretty soon. So, And then in, you didn't watch my last video. I did put money into the bank before I moved. So I made these like fake $100 bills just to keep like in place of the actual money because I like to count it. So we have $150, $200, $250 gifts. And then I need to buy two birthday presents for people. So this might be like empty. For stationery, we're putting in ten dollars, and then I'm also planning to buy stationery soon. So we have twenty, thirty, forty, and then we have bubbies, which is getting fifty dollars. I decided to um, increase the amount I put in here because. 
Christmas is almost coming and he gets his own envelope for money. I'm not touching my Christmas fund unless like it's not enough. So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, 115, 120, 125. And then spending is getting $10. I also, I think I upped this too. So now spending has 20, 40, 50, 55. 60, 65, 70. $70 in spending. And then giving is getting five as always. And now giving has $15. I haven't had to use this yet, but I'll probably start using it as tip money for people. And then deposit isn't getting anything. So that's it for the cash envelopes. And then for sinking fund. <coughs> My cash savings challenge for the 52 week challenge, I'm going to be putting in $50 a day because I decided I'm not going to do it in order anymore because I'm going to do it depending on my paycheck and then like if I get paid more, I'm going to put in more. So we have 400 in the bank. So we have 1, 100, 200, 300, 400, 450, 500, 520, 30, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55. $555 in this already. <gasps> That's so good. I can't wait to finish this challenge. I'm definitely going to do it again. For car, we're putting in $20. And then we have 400 for car in the bank. So, we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 420, 440, 41, 42, 43. $443. And then luxury is getting $10. So now luxury has 10, 20, 25. And then sorry if you guys can hear my washer and dryer right now. Um, for doggy, doggy is getting $5. Now we have 10, 15, 20, 25. And then travel is getting $20. So now we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 420, 440. So 400 in the bank and 40 in the envelope. Events will be getting $5. And now we have 5, 10, 15, 20. And then school is getting $20. I had to buy a lot of textbooks so I don't have any money in here anymore. So we have 20, 25, 26, and I need to buy one more, and I think this is enough, hopefully. Emergency is getting $10. So now we have $20 in emergency. And just so everyone knows, I do like have like an emergency savings, which has $2,000 in it, so that's why I don't stuff this a lot. Beauty is getting $5. I need to buy an exfoliator, so I might. Do that this week we'll see and then we have 5 10 11 12 dollars in beauty and then in technology we're putting in 10 dollars so now we have 10 25 25 dollars in technology and then for metal for future we're putting in five and now we have $15. And then for medical, we're putting in $25. So now we have 20, 40, 60, 65, 70. I'm sorry you guys can hear all that background noise. And then for Christmas, we're putting in $50 as always. So we have 600 in the bank. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 600, 650, 700. It's so close to the goal, which is $1,000. And the apartment is getting 
20 dollars so i have 20 25 26 which is perfect because i'm gonna buy an espresso sand to hold my espresso pods okay and then i did say that i wanted to step half of my rollover money so i'm gonna pull out half of it to stuff so we have 20 40 60 70 80 90 one 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, 105, 6, 7. So we're going to do, let's do 50. Okay, I'm going to do two times. So that's 40, 45, 50, and I'm going to stuff the ones. And then I'm going to keep the rest and roll over in case I need it in there. So let's go through and see what I want to put it into. If there's, I think for stationery, I'm going to put in $10. Because I want to treat myself to some stuff. So we're going to put, now we have 20, 30, 40, 50. And then for spending, I kind of want to buy new clothes. So I think I'm going to put 10 in here as well. So now we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80. And then that'll be that for the cash envelope binder. And then now we still have $32 to stay. So I think in luxury, I'm gonna go ahead and put another $5 in there. So we have 10, 20, 25, 30. And then for school, I'm gonna go ahead and put the $7 in there. So we have 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33. put the $20 into technology because I think I might have to buy a new phone by the end of the year but we'll see but I just want to have as much as I can when it comes around because I think that's like the only thing I really want to stuff right now or I'm gonna put in 15 so I put in the $20 bill but I want to put in 15 so I'm gonna take out five because I'm gonna stuff another one so we have 20 30 40 for technology and then I'm gonna put that five into apartment just because I feel like I always need stuff for the apartment. So now we have 20, 25, 30, 31. Okay. So thank you for watching my videos today, guys. I'm sorry I couldn't do the budget with me, but I will do that next time. And also I'm gonna do like um, a page setup because a lot of people have been asking me to do a page setup. So I might go ahead and do that for the next video, but that'll be it for this stuffing. And thank you for watching and thank you for all the new subscribers. It really means a lot to me. I'm so sorry the last video's volume was too low. I hope this one is better. So remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!